video is all about having fun while mastering how to solve systems of equations by substitution. It's a blitz game. It's competitive, easy to create, and tons of fun to play. All the components of this activity are on glennatabor.com and they are free. Just visit my website, join the Tabor team, which is free, download and start to use. This game is another winner for understanding in a simple hands-on way a really tough and abstract algebraic concept. Or, well, let's see, you could just um, memorize these steps and uh, finish a worksheet. Yeah, doesn't that sound like fun? No, not exactly. So let's play a game that will engage learners and teach them a complex concept at the same time. For this game, you will need eight sets of cards for each player or pair. Each set goes with a system of equations that can be solved by substitution. I organize my cards into envelopes and put the system card on the front. Now, I only have two here. All are available on glennatabor.com. The goal of this game is to think about the system of equations on the front of the envelope and use the cards inside to substitute the value of the variable into the second equation. It'll make sense after we play. <laughs> Every player or pair selects the same envelope with the same system of equations on the front. Set a timer for one to two minutes and encourage players to think about how they could substitute the value of this equation on the top into the bottom equation in for that variable. All players put their hands on their shoulders, the leader says go, and all players or pairs race to see who can be first to organize the cards into an equation that will find the value of one of the variables. So I know y is equal to 3x, and this is, so this is okay, 5x, plus two, well, that's five X plus two Y, and I know that Y is equal to three X, so it's a plus three X and a plus three X, and it equals, now, to provide for some much needed movement, which players need sometimes, players stand when they believe they have correctly organized the cards. The leader, Glances at the answer key to confirm who is the winner. The first player or pair to stand and have the correct organization wins 10 points. Any other player or pair who organized the equation correctly wins five points. And play continues until all of the cards and the envelopes have been used. To provide documentation of the understanding of the concept, we're also going to use a recording sheet. Your students or learners will record three of the systems that they have knowledge of because they played the game using these cards. Players will feel empowered by their ability to select the three they want to solve. You can see already what we're going to do. We're going to combine like terms and then we are going to solve for X and substitute in to sell, solve for Y. Like what you saw? Then give it a thumbs up. What would you do differently? Tell me in the comments below. <laughs> I'd love to know how you have fun with your learners. Want more? Then subscribe to this channel. Want to be the first one to use a new game? Then ring the bell so you'll be notified as soon as a new game is uploaded. That's, that, that's it. You did it. <laughs> you proved you can have fun learning about solving systems of equations by substitution by manipulating cards. Way to go.